They'll send Roundtree, split him out to the right. Bazelak will throw that way, and Larry can't hold on, which is going to be interesting today. He's a lot of eye candy in this offense against this Georgia defense that has really pressured the quarterback. Bazelak lofts one up, and that one is picked off. Eric Stokes with the interception. He already has two pick sixes this year. And Stokes will turn the corner, and Georgia has outstanding field position as Stokes just grabbed his fourth interception of the year. Second possession now for Missouri. They'll start the 25. They'll hand it. Eli Drinkwood says he doesn't like to use the tight end, keep backs in. He does it, tries to slow down a rush with eye candy as Roundtree. Because Eli Drinkwood, his offense is going to make it really difficult on Georgia. This time they'll fake it to Knox, do a little shovel pass underneath to the tight end, Daniel Parker. That didn't go very well. They'll hand it to him straight off the right side. Runs into a wall of white jerseys. That's Bannister across the fo formation. Three receivers in the near side on a third down and eight. Georgia bringing four. Over the middle pass is caught right at midfield. Missouri's been good on third downs. Almost 47% on the year and convert there to keep this drive alive. Give it to Roundtree right in the middle of that Georgia defense. Nothing there. Let's go downstairs, check in with Lauren. Yeah, I think confidence is something we, we could just, uh, is oozing from Missouri offensively right now. Maybe not so much defensively after last week. They'll get it to Bannister. He gets to midfield, stood up. Really shifty receiver in space. Another third down and long. Georgia bringing four. Bazelak under pressure. Connor. He's just going to have to slide around the 48 day with the wind howling at Memorial Stadium in Columbia. Another little toss to the wide receiver, Deontay Smith. Move the football. They got to pick up some first downs. They have to try to get some points on the board because right now their defense is really. Here comes some pressure. Bazelak sees it, gets it to Roundtree. Larry, first down and a whole lot more. Biggest play of the game for Missouri. Quick throw coming near side. Pass is caught by Jalen Knox. He's into Georgia territory. Give him six, maybe seven. Basil exit eight out of ten to start this game. Here's Roundtree. Hit that hole in a hurry and just picked up a Missouri first down. They will fake it to Beatty. Basilak coming near side. That pass is caught. Really in four years that they haven't played for an SEC championship. They've been to three straight championship games but not this year as the Gators and Alabama set to go next weekend Missouri on movement before every snap Bazelak goes under center they'll send Kiki Chisholm in motion and they'll throw to him the old double pass perhaps Chisholm going up top has a man pass is caught inside the five yard line Messiah Swinson we got a Missouri a trick play something that gets the defense off balance Roundtree, they fake it to him, and Bazelak will score the touchdown. There'll be some shakeups. I hope they are ready for all the different scenarios that could pop up. Missouri, and Roundtree makes the catch out to the 25-yard line. Give him five there. Uh, you see him in second and four. There's not a lot of stress on the offense here when you have good success early. Run a little option game. Bazelak, who ran that offense in high school, takes it there, but is hit hard and is not moving. He's slowly getting to his feet. Crowd wanted a flag. Ball game with a really good defense. Not a bad play just to hand it off to 34 a couple of times here. Looked like a little miscommunication in the backfield, but it works out as Tyler Beatty makes that reception. Keep this drive going. We'll send Beatty out to the near side. Empty set. 
That throw is batted down, incomplete. Last two drives, 13 plays, 51 yards, and two punts. Connor Bazelak back in the game after taking that shot in the last possession. Will hand it off to the right side. Good, strong running. I don't even know if you need an ice pack today. It's so cold huh. in Como. Yeah, just sit outside, right? But you got to keep, got to keep an eye on it. You, you can watch Bazelak through this. He's going to continue to. 51. Five-yard penalty remains second down. First penalty of the game for either team. Second down and six now. Straight handoff to Roundtree, and he ran right into the middle of that defense. <laughs> Bazilak hit as he throws, lofts it up in the air. It is almost intercepted. Pass interference on the defense, number 13. That's a spot foul. Automatic first down. Good drive. You got three minutes to go over half. Georgia gets the ball at half, so Missouri would love to be able to get some points here. Bazelak, nowhere to go with that one. Barrett Bannister goes in motion. Georgia bringing some extra rushers. Bazelak flushed out of the pocket. Throws on the run. It is incomplete. So tap it. To Beatty, who is stuffed for a yard loss. Roundtree, straight handoff, dives for the end zone. Got close to the goal line, but then pushed back. Monty Rice, the first one there amongst the Georgia defenders. They've got the tight end. Parker lined up in the backfield. They'll run that way. Roundtree trying to get to the end zone, and he does. Touchdown, Larry Roundtree and Missouri. Yeah, Missouri's not going to go anywhere. This is a team that's continued to fight all year. Got some other SEC games going on next week during the course of the day. Connor Bazelak took a couple of shots in that first half, but stays in the game. Going up top on his first pass, and it is caught on the sideline by way of Virginia Tech. He bobbled snap. Bazelak, though, calmly... Lofts it and throws it away. No. This might rattle him, though, the Georgia pressure. Here's another time for a big third down call here. Trying to set up the screen to Beatty. He's got a long way to go, and he's not going to get there. Holding on the offense, number 82. That's a 10-yard penalty. Replay, third down. SEC East Championships in 13 and 14. Third and 15. Pressure comes. Bazelak hit as he throws again in the air, and this one is incomplete. It was a quick read. It is a beautifully written story by Wright Thompson. Pass is caught there. Put something together here on this drive. Some movement up front. Going to back up Missouri. On the offense, number 72, five-yard penalty, second down. Bazelak, quick hitter. That one is in the air. Is it picked up? They're going to say incomplete that it hit the turf. Georgia bringing three. Had uh, all the answers to defend him. Here's Roundtree, and they've had answers to defend Mr. Roundtree as well. Who Georgia's been styled at the point of attack here in the run game. They'll fake it to Roundtree. Bootleg this way. And the pass is caught. They will hand it off to Knox. Trying to get the corner in. He is hit and dropped out of bounds by Tyson Campbell. And they've contested throws on the outside, and it's been tough for Missouri and Bazelak to get anything going consistently. They'll go with Roundtree. For Georgia, to be honest, they've played on the other side, and they haven't really been pushed around. 
But this is a team that's going to be competing for it for a long time to come in the next few years. But Missouri and Basilac are going to be right in that territory as well. Basilac underneath throw. That pass is caught by Kiki Chisholm. When given the time, he has been accurate and efficient. Basilac stays in the game at quarterback on a first down and 10. Pass is caught by Kiki Chisholm. We'll come back next year, and I know they still got another game next week, but it'd be fun to see this team grow. High throw incomplete. All right. But regardless of what happens, uh, a big shout out to these universities, their medical staffs, the players, the coaches, the fact that they're going to be close to finishing this season around the league as well. Dump it off underneath the round tree. Point that Georgia knows that they won't have coming back. So maybe that helps kind of clear things up for, for Kirby in some regards. Coach's standpoint has been a little bit different and sometimes a little bit difficult too. Georgia offensively, 18.7 yards per completion. They're having chunk plays all over the field, and Missouri just was not able to win those 50-50 opportunities. Twins. I think most people thought this team would win two, three games this year. Just shy of 300 yards. 299 through the air for JT. Bad snap. And Brady Cook will be dropped 